da 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 But if everybody knows Hamtaro, of course, everyone knows Drymon. Drymon is huge. It's huge in Japan. Again, it's for babies. Huh, all right. It's for babies. It's for little, 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 little kids. And there are uh, more, more, there are more exciting adventures, I think. Sure. Sure, than Hamtaro, but but not too much. The age of the audience is about the same. Um, that the basic idea of Draimon is it's about a, a blue cat robot. That's right. It's a robot cat, and it's blue, and he lives with this family. That's a very ordinary family. It looks like every family in Japan. It's not so special. It's just the usual family. Okay. And uh, this cat is like any other cat, even though he's a robot. Even though he's a robot, this cat is, is very curious about things, just like all cats do. Get curious about things. Yeah. And and because he's curious, just like some cats, when he wanders outside, he gets into a little trouble. And sometimes the trouble, he needs help to get out of the trouble. So he involves his uh, friends, you know, the boy and the girl and the family. And sometimes the parents get involved and they go and they, uh, and they get this cat out of trouble. Sometimes the trouble is too big for the family, but lucky Lucky for them, uh, this cat is a robot, and because he's a robot, he can fly, he can be a jet person, he can go underwater, but usually he flies. He has a little uh, helicopter that comes out of his top of his head and he flies around. But another thing, another thing that this robot cat can do is sometimes this cat can go back in time. Yeah, yeah, so... When this cat gets into trouble and his friends have to help him, he will go back in time and bring his friends with him. And they have these adventures in ancient Egypt or in medieval English times or, or uh, Japan during the Heian period or ancient Korea or, or America in the 1950s. Yeah, and the kids, they learn a lot about history by watching Draymond. So there you go. Uh, it, if you want to know how to spell Draymond, it will be in the show notes at the bottom of this video. So you can see Draymond. So I talked about Hamtaro, which is very slow paced, very relaxed cartoon. And then Draymon, which is a little more exciting, but it's kind of crazy. It's fantasy because it's about a uh, robot cat.